The more we understand, the more we can help people. I believe that exercise should be part of the standard management of Parkinson's disease. Parkinson's is a progressive degenerative disease, so it's going to get worse. What we're hoping to do with exercise is try to maintain a higher level of function and quality of life in the presence of a degenerative disease. The Center for Neurorehabilitation focuses on bridging that gap between research and clinical practice because we're bringing our research to the clinic immediately. And rather than have that lag time between discovery and implementation, we drive that seamlessly. We've taken it all the way from concepts and theory-driven uh, hypotheses to tomorrow, when you see this patient, you should do X, Y, and Z in order to help them walk better. The other unique feature here is that we have students that are eager to participate. I have so many volunteers, it's phenomenal. And the people with Parkinson's disease really enjoy interacting with the students. They teach our students all about Parkinson's disease in a way that is very personal and it's exciting. They feel like they're contributing to the education of the students and the students really feel like they benefit from the real live learning in the moment. And, you know, they just learned about Parkinson's disease in the classroom, and then they go upstairs and interact with people with Parkinson's disease. It doesn't get better than that. Exercise is basically the main target of my research. I mean, I'm trying to understand what the crucial components are of a rehabilitation program. We study the walking ability of individuals with Parkinson's disease and relate their ability to the neurological symptoms. We use very sophisticated equipment that allows us to do 3D motion analysis of their walking uh, patterns. And on the basis of that, we try to design interventions that optimize their walking behavior. We basically are in the process of developing wireless functional activity monitors. And those are small devices. We want them to be the size of, of a watch. And they include very sensitive sensors. So what I try to do basically is bring my lab to the home setting. We want to implement treatment and influence their behavior directly. The unique aspect of the Center for New Rehabilitation is the, the interdisciplinary focus on the problems that patients with Parkinson's disease experience in their in the home and community setting. And then it's the science in order to underpin the clinical care activities that we uh, carry out in our centers. I feel like this work is important because this is a paradigm shift. The role of exercise is critical in the management of people with Parkinson's disease and is underappreciated. We can improve quality of life and day-to-day -day function of people with Parkinson's disease now.